extreme storms, hotter seasons. With a specialized degree in climate, he's pioneering the way we look at climate and how it affects our weather. Now, climate specialist Jeff Berardelli. We are firmly on track toward an unlivable world. That's the headline from the newly released UN report on climate change mitigation. The report states it's now or never to limit warming below critical levels. But in order to do that, we need immediate and deep cuts in greenhouse gas emissions from the burning of fossil fuels. So let's see how our energy use has changed our atmosphere since the industrial revolution. And uh, so take a look. What we're looking at here is 800,000 years on the bottom of carbon dioxide in the atmosphere. And you can see that it goes up and down because of ice age cycles. But here's the key. It has never gone above 300 parts per million. There's 300. Until 1910 when it did. And since then, it has shot straight up to 420 parts per million. So as you can see, that's very abnormal. But let's see how abnormal it is. It is the highest concentration of carbon dioxide in the atmosphere in 4.5 million years, and it's the fastest rate of rise in 66 million years. So it goes to show you that we are basically guinea pigs in our own experiment. And it's changing already the atmosphere and the oceans in various ways. And one of those ways is it's, you can see, warming the global temperatures, around two degree increase since 1850. There's 1850, the blue temperatures below normal. And look at this, shooting up just over the past 50 years or so, uh, the red is warmer temperatures. And that's obviously causing stronger hurricanes, bigger floods, bigger fires, so on and so forth. Now the good news, we have the technology to solve this and we can afford it. Since 2010, the cost of solar, wind and batteries have plunged by 85%. We're gonna dig more into this later in the week. Jen?